Hi there. Um, is this the TikTok office? Ah, uh, yes, this is TikTok. Come on in. How can we help? Well, I love the service and everything, um, but I just have a wee complaint. Okay, go right ahead. Well, I really like the cooking videos that you guys are serving up to me. Uh, I really like the cat videos as well, they're very cute. And the comedy videos, they're, they're absolutely perfect. Right, uh, I'll inform the algorithm. Ah, uh, yes. So, so I told the algorithm that I liked all of those things, but whenever I load up TikTok, it only serves me up sexy dancing ladies. Hmm, hmm. Okay. So, what's the problem? I don't want to see sexy dancing ladies. Oh! Oh! It says right here that you do want to see sexy dancing ladies. What do you mean? Uh, the algorithm states quite clearly that you do want to see sexy dancing ladies. I never told the algorithm that. Sorry, uh, hang on. It says, whenever we serve up sexy dancing ladies, on average you look 38% longer than other videos. Yeah, but I don't want to see sexy dancing ladies. Ah, uh, but you do look, don't you? I mean, of course I look. They're sexy dancing ladies, but I don't want the algorithm serving that up to me. Look, I am just trying to do my job here. We serve you up videos based on your preferences, and your preferences quite clearly state that you do like sexy dancing ladies. Well, I want it to stop. Okay, okay. I hear what you're saying, but I did want to show you this first. <laughs> Oh, what? What? Haha, -ha. you looked. Oh, of course I looked, it right in my face. You could have looked away, but you didn't. Why are you doing this to me? We are testing out your preferences to perfectly cater to you. Ah, how do you know my brain so well? <laughs> More dancing ladies. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> If she sees me watching this, I'll get in trouble! <laughs> I don't want it! <laughs> yes. I don't want it! I don't want it! <laughs> yes, algorithm up the percentage of sexy dancing ladies. He fing loves them. <laughs> Hey, uh, I was told to come here. Yes, welcome, welcome. Hello. We have a very special friendship for you to celebrate. Come on in and take a seat. Uh, sorry, I don't really have time, I gotta- It'll only take a minute. And hey, aren't friendships something worth celebrating? Okay, you know what? Great, let's do it. Sure. Brilliant. Well, come on in and let's celebrate friendship. Okay. Uh, hey, I was told to come in here. Welcome, welcome. Please take a seat. Uh, okay. Um. Uh, hey, man. Look. Bringing friends together. Hashtag love it. Sorry, I don't really know who this guy is. Yeah, neither. Am I in the right place? <laughs> you certainly are. Adam and Alan? Alan and Adam, like two peas in a pod. Did we go to high school together or something? Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Hmm. Let's look back at some friendship. Amazing. Do you remember that? No. Oh, and that? It's the same photo as the one before. Oh, the memories. The memories. Were we even in that photo? Oh, wow. <laughs> <sighs> wow. The bond that you two share. Is there anything more important than friendship? Hey, man, I don't want to be rude, but is it okay if we unfriend one another? I was literally about to say the same thing. Cool. It's just, I don't really know, like, why... Oh, you don't need to explain yourself to me. I've been meaning to have a massive Facebook friend, Cole. It gets a little bit like that, eh? Like, I look at my Facebook feed sometimes, I'm like, who are these people? I know what you mean. Yeah. Oh, okay, let me just take um... a quick look here. Oh, yeah, there you yeah, are. Got you. Okay, cool. And... Unfriend. Yep, done. Okay, sweet. Bye. See ya. 
friendship! What's that? Hey. Hey man, I'm just going to give you a shout out in exchange for this keyboard. All goods? What? Oh, sorry, I'm going to shout out your store on my Instagram in exchange for this keyboard. Chur? Uh, okay, so the Razer Huntsman Mini, that's $189. What? No, 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 okay, you're not picking up what I'm putting down. Uh, I don't want to pay with money. I want to pay with exposure. No. What do you mean, no? I mean, we only accept money for our products. Okay, look, I think there's been a bit of a misunderstanding. No, I understand. No, you don't. Because what I'm offering you is infinitely more valuable than money. I'm offering you exposure on my Instagram. Oh, I literally don't care. It's $189 cash or credit. What? No, okay. <laughs> you, you obviously don't know who I am, so let me help you out. I'm Benjamin. Like, you're Benjamin! In the flesh, in front of you, right now, IRL. And I have over 2,000 followers on my Instagram. And? And have you not done the math, mate? If I give you a shout out, that's 2,000 people who are gonna be influenced by me to buy the exact same product. That is definitely not how the world works. Oh, you are passing on the opportunity of a lifetime here, mate. Look, I'm gonna do you a favor and fulfill my end of the bargain right now. Here we go. Hey, what's up, jammers? It's your boy, Ben Jammin. Ya Ben Jammin, I Ben Jammin. I'm about to be jamming with this keyboard. It looks super dope and shit, Chur. Sweet. No, you Sweet. need to stop, that is stealing. You are stealing right now. Have you completely ignored our conversation so far? I'm taking this. If you take that, I will literally call the police. You can't do that. A deal's a deal, mate. We never came to a deal. What's going on? F okay, Ron, this customer is trying to exchange this keyboard for a shitty little Instagram story. How many followers does he have? 2,000. Uh, 2,127. Whoa. What's the, what's the offer? I was going to give you a shout out in exchange for this keyboard. No, that's ridiculous. Uh, 2,000 guaranteed sales in exchange for one keyboard sounds pretty good to me. Again, not how the world works. Think about it, Alan. 2,000 guaranteed customers for life in exchange for just one free keyboard. You know, now that I hear you put it that way, I'm not sure I want this deal anymore. Good. What if we throw in a free mouse? Chuck in a headset, you got a deal. Deal. Sure. Pleasure, not you. You, not you. Got a thing long term, mate. Mm. Mm. Oh. Okay. Hey, I love your photos. Have you thought about modeling? Hey, I love your photos. Have you ever thought about modeling? Oh my God, yes. Thank you so much. I mean, are you serious though? Look who's talking. You are like so beautiful. I just, I, I can't even. Um, oh my God. Thank you so much. That genuinely means a lot coming from you. I feel like so flattered right now. I mean, you are like seriously stunning. What made you want to like check out my profile? Okay. This is kind of embarrassing. No, I can't. Oh, come on, you have to tell me. No, I can't. You cannot just leave me hanging like that. Okay, do you promise not to laugh? 
I promise. So, full disclosure, I think you're more than just beautiful. I think you're really sexy. I think you're really sexy. What do you mean? I mean, I have a serious crush on you right now. Like I have a serious crush on you right now. Oh my God, I have like the biggest crush on you. <gasps> That's amazing. Um. Uh... Okay, this might sound a bit forward, but what are you wearing? Oh. <laughs> oh my god, um, uh, what if I told you to take up the towel? I've already taken it off. <laughs> oh, it's on. <laughs> oh, so what are you wearing? I'm just in my lacy underwear. Oh my god, that's so hot. Mm. <laughs> Hey Rowan, look at my TikTok. Adam's just showing me a TikTok and I f***ing hate it. What do I do? You could try and give him a compliment sandwich. What's a compliment sandwich? So you give him a compliment and then you give him some constructive feedback and then you end it with another compliment. So positive, negative, positive. Yep, you got it. Adam, in regards to your TikTok, I really like your watch. Oh, thanks, Ron. That TikTok was the worst thing that I've ever seen. You're a terrible dancer. I can't believe that a 30-something-year-old man is actually on TikTok dancing like the little girls that dance on TikTok. You're an embarrassment. You're a terrible person. I f***ing hate you. I f***ing hated that. That was so f***ing embarrassing that I'm cringing right now. You're a cringy person. That was so terrible. I hate you. You're an inferior being. Everything about you is pathetic. You're a pathetic person. Watching you do that actually made me want to vomit. You. you have really nice shoes. Thanks for the constructive feedback, Rowan. I'm gonna go make more TikToks! Yes! That was effective. It's not bad. I'm gonna find the love of my life today. Right. Oh, hey. Hi, uh, Brian. I like your shirt. Oh, thanks. I got it on this fishing trip with the lads. It was insane, eh? Dougal and I, we caught this monster of a snapper. You want to see it? Oh, no. That's OK. Oh, that's like a dead fish. Yeah, I just love killing things, eh? I got this real nice deer right between the eyes. You want to see that? No. <laughs> no, thank you. I'm going to show you anyway. No, no, no. No, 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 no. What, what the fuck? You know what? No. It was probably just a false start. Okay. Hi. Shit. Do you have like a, a shirt you could maybe put on? Shit. Do you own any shirts? No. Oh. <laughs> I get the joke. What's this for you? Nope. Uh, no. Hi. Sorry, is this just a picture of you and your girlfriend that you've cropped? No. no, no. Oh, <laughs> right. That's my wife. Love chicks, eh? Yeah. Whoa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Chicks the best. Yeah, yeah. Is there a Doug here? <laughs> Doug? She was just. Hello. Doug? Who the fuck uploads a group photo? I'll do this guy. Hi, how's it going? Honestly, I am like a second away from deleting this app. It is literal hell in here. I know what you mean. It, it feels so hard to make a genuine, meaningful connection with someone when there's just literally so many people to choose from. Yeah, it's like, uh, I just find it really difficult to communicate. It's kind of, it makes me feel like it's a game show, you know? Right, it feels exactly like a game show. It's horrible. <laughs> <sighs> wow, I, I actually feel like we are making a connection. Really? Yeah. Uh, 
Actually, can I ask you something? What? What do you think of this? Fuck you! Fuck you! Hate this stupid app! Yo, you know I want to see a movie? Yeah, Keen, what time? Uh, I'm just at work right now, but I should be free around seven. Seven works for me. Grab something to eat, maybe? Mate. Okay, I'm just running into a meeting right now, but keep me posted, all right? Okay. Ugh, have you guys ever been in a meeting that just could have been an email? Well, that was you can such just a waste of yourself. Look, Ali, could you just be rational for once? This isn't about you. Oh, come on, Rowan, that's so messed up, bro. I can't believe you would be this ignorant. Oh, come at me, bitch. Oh, shit. You know what? I bet Alan agrees with me, don't you, Alan? Uh, yeah, totally, man. Sh sure. That's disgusting. Alan, what the hell? Because I'm gonna be honest, I actually don't really know what we're Please. talking about. You guys need to chill out. You don't have you no idea. Oh, How really? You really? Just really? Just really? Oh, that's insane. How that's you insane. Yeah. You're gonna so this? It's okay. crazy. Look, even the ancient Romans had this figured out. Oh, what would you know about the Romans? Where what would I know? What would I know? From? Oh, okay. Yeah, so yeah. Ah, you're wrong! You can't get into it and you should feel bad about it! How's this for an opinion? Ah, okay, have you seen this cat girl? <laughs> oh, he he jumped straight off it. So, what are we feeling for dinner? Pizza? Oh, yeah. Actually, I would kill for a Hawaiian. Oh, wait. You don't like pineapple on pizza, do you? Uh, yeah. It's ah, delicious. okay. No, I got not. it. Listen, he got it. Shit. Okay, guys, I've got it. I do have a, I think pineapple does have a place on pizza. I agree with Rowan, okay? But both of your opinions are valid. It's not everybody's cup of tea, and that's okay. Okay, it's not a traditional topping, but food is always changing and culture is always evolving. And at the end of the day, I think just, you know, pineapple or no pineapple, just live and let live, you know? Bro, Ben's aunt just died. What? Yeah, Ellen, try to keep up, bro. Come on, man. Oh, God damn it. And there we go. Signed. Thanks so much for coming in. It's nice to meet you. Thank you. What was that? Uh, what? What was that? It was nothing. Don't know, it's nothing. That was not nothing. What? What is happening? <laughs> Uh, that was a fan. They recognized me from my Instagram page. Sorry, what? Oh, I have like a little small Instagram page that I run. <laughs> you have an Instagram page? Yeah, but it's nothing, it's nothing. I bet it's nothing. What would you even post? Well, you know, this and that. And this and that gets your followers, does it? Quite a few. Do you want to know how many followers I've got? Oh, I've... Uh, two, five, six, baby. 256 triple digits. Boom. That's great, Rowan. Nice. I am sure. Uh, okay. Triple digits. That's cool. Photos of you. Yeah. Show me yours. Uh, no, it's okay. No, go on. I showed you mine. Show me yours. Just cool it. Oh, it's okay. I don't know. Okay. Just don't. show me. Just show me. Oh, oh I, I, I really show shouldn't. me yours. I want to see how many followers you got. I, I, I shouldn't, Rowan. No. What are you embarrassed? Just show me. No, don't, no. Pull out your phone and show me. M maybe just, later. Just, like, just show me. No. Just fucking show me. Okay, okay. Um. <laughs> so stupid. Four hundred and thirty-six. Thousand. The K means thousand. It kind of all snowballed from my TikTok when I got famous on there. And then it, it kind of became an Instagram thing after that. But I still do the TikTok as well. Why didn't I know about this? Oh, it's just something I do for myself. I mean, like, Playtech's great and all, but, like, I need to make money somehow. And plus, it's my passion. Do you make money off this? Oh, yeah. A, a fair amount of money. When do you do all this? Well, I do it outside of Playtech. Outside of Playtech? 
Yeah, like, like in my free time. Free time? Yeah, you know, your free time. Like, you must have lots of exciting things that you do outside of Playtech that I don't know about. Don't you think it's so important to have a passion, like something that makes life all worthwhile? Something outside of your work. Like, wouldn't it be so terrible if work was everything you had in your life? Like, if Playtech was it, if you didn't have anything outside of Playtech. Wouldn't that be boring? Wouldn't that be depressing? Like, day in, day out, day in, day out. I can't imagine. It would more like abysmal and pathetic if that was all you did. If you worked until the end of your life with no passion. You know what I mean, Ron? Huh. Do you know what I mean? Totally. Ron? <laughs> Totally. Yes. You suck as much as your mum does. That's not fair, you cheated. Yeah, good, good, noob, GG, easy. Oh, you mother Hey everyone, look at my cosplay. I'm Zelda from Twilight Princess. I'd like to twilight your princess, if you know what I mean. So, what's up? I just punished this kid in Fortnite. Nice, dude. Load up, Cod. Yeah, boy. Yes, sweet. Load it up. Hi, James. I just wanted to say you look lovely in this photo with your friends. Is that girl next to you a potential girlfriend? Wink, wink. <laughs> Much love, Mumsy. Oh, man, this game takes forever to load. Yeah, the fing servers have been a little beard. Yeah, they need to fix their fing servers. It's a joke. Yeah. Fing servers. That is disgusting. This is about me trying to show off my art. F off. You're just using your tits to farm upvotes. This is not about my body. This is about me showing off the hard work that I have put into this costume. <laughs> okay, keep telling yourself that while all these guys touch their dicks. Actually, was that photo taken in Wellington? That reminds me of the time we were all there when you were young and you whipped out your little willy in the main square and shouted, Fire Hose Brigade, and you ran up and down peeing. Oh, <laughs> delete. <laughs> Mum. Subject, written warning. James, I specifically told you that I wanted those quarterly reports by the end of day Friday, and when I saw you log out of your remote desktop at 3 p.m., oh. Oh, well, something happened to the comment and it disappeared, love. Well, what I said was, it reminded me Delete. of- Delete. Fuck. Ooh. Throw back to summer. Oh, shit. Oh, what the fuck? The world is on fire and you don't even oh, care. Hashtag up. save the trees. You suck on a bag of I could kick your ass in real life. Can you do the update? Are I you told getting you these the messages? Jane, oh Mum, stop. I do not email. appreciate what you being you 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 It's just a joke. You can't even acknowledge your own problem. You're just a little kid in your mum's basement, bitch. Nice people don't have your mum's basement. Oh, man, you are so unintended. I don't even need your job. Fuck you. Hi, honey, how's it going? We missed you at family dinner last night. Sorry. We'd love to see you this weekend. Okay, then. Talk later. Love you. Sorry, Miss Dinner. Some stuff came up. We'd love to see you tomorrow. Actually, yeah, I'd really like that. It'd be amazing if you could make your world famous pot pie. <sighs> yeah, cool. Well, it will be lovely to see you. We haven't seen you properly in so long. I'm really sorry about that, Mum. Things have been pretty rough recently with my mental health. I'm not in a good spot, and I don't want you to see me like that. And it's getting worse. Being cooped up, working from home, it's, it's really taking its toll. And I just, I feel like I've got no one to talk to. 
know, I, I used to be able to talk, but now I just feel myself shutting down and shutting myself off from you and the rest of the family about how I'm feeling. There are days when I don't even get out of bed. I've been in some really dark spots and I don't know how to get out. See you then. Lovely. Can't wait to see you. Welcome to Roll Diggity Pranks, your number one place for pranks in this fast, fast paced world. Let's go. I want to bring smiles to people's hearts and joy to people's faces. I'm here pranking my staff today, who are also my best friends. Let's go. Yeah, that's pretty good. What the fuck? Roll pranked! <laughs> Booyah! Gotcha, boy. Try working now. <laughs> Roll pranked. What? Yeah, 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 just got roll pranked. <laughs> roll pranks, boy. Roll pranked. This will be a fun new thing. <sighs> what? Roll pranked. <laughs> Rowan, did you put glass in my food? <laughs> you should have seen your face. Can you imagine if you actually ate that? <laughs> Row pranked. Rowan, what's wrong with you? <laughs> Row pranked. <laughs> <laughs> Pranked. <gasps> I just got row pranked, my man. Nice. Hey guys, that concludes this week's F of Roll Diggity Pranks, your number one place for pranks in this fast, fast paced world. Let's go. <laughs> hey Adam. Yeah? What was the, um, what were the spices in that spice chicken recipe that you This made? is a delightful dish to spice up your weekdays. Sorry, what were the spices? This Moroccan inspired meal is a favorite at home. Whether or not you're looking for a warm winter meal for the family or something to wow the dinner guests, this is the recipe for you. And the spices in that were? If you're anything like me, you lived in a pretty standard English household of meat and three veg. Boring, am I right? Yeah, look, we know you didn't eat well as a child, Adam. What were the spices though? Now, I first traveled to Morocco in the early 90s as a teenager. My auntie took me there because she had quite a wonderland. Adam, you don't even have an auntie. She traveled the world and took me along for the ride. <sighs> Morocco is a North African country bordering the Atlantic Ocean and the Mediterranean Sea. Oh, for sake, I don't need a history Between lesson. Algeria, one day I hope to travel there again, but the winds of the world have yet to whisk me that way. However, I have been to Italy and Southern France and oh la la. <laughs> Head on over to hellofresh.co.nz for 20 oh, come on. Get yourself a toaster at Best Buy. There are ah. This ad cannot be displayed. Long. 40 percent off car parts. Head on down. Give me the recipe, please. Moroccan recipes make you don't need to hear any of this part. A cone-shaped cooking vessel that makes Just mouth watering with delicious bread. The recipe. For this recipe, you'll need the following ingredients. Yes, come on. Chicken. Obviously. Olive oil. Yep. Onion. Salt and pepper. I swear to God. Garlic. Lemon. Tomato. Chicken bread. If the next words out of your mouth aren't the spices that I need, I'm going to stab you. And you'll also need cumin, turmeric, cinnamon, and parsley. Thank you. Bon appetit. <sighs> Jesus. It's not that difficult, is it? Cumin. Cumin, turmeric. Uh, fuck. Fuck. Hey Adam. Yeah? 
What were the last two spices? It's a delightful dish to spice ah, up your weekdays. No, no. This Moroccan inspired meal is always a favorite at home. Oh, fucking hell. Believe it or not, there are a few bloopers in this one. Yeah. Yeah, strangely enough. Uh, and if you want to see those, uh, there's a Patreon button that way. There's one. Hey, it's over there, along with some more videos. It's but yeah. worth it. It's worth it. I would, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm subscribed she's, to she's Patreon. She's over there.